you guys it's Tammy we're talking with Tammy this is my all new season and I am so excited that today I have my boyfriend in my brain here today <laughs> and this is Steve McKenzie he's the owner of Larson Jewel and this is a fabulous headquarters right that's where we are. Hey, so tell everybody about your company. Well, Larson Jewel has a history of over 100 years, and we manufacture and distribute custom picture frames all over the world. We have operations in 100, or 19 different countries, and we do both production, design, and distribution, and we sell through custom picture framing retailers. Wow. So tell me how you guys started in this business. Me personally? Mm-hmm. Well, it was about 20 years ago that I joined Larson Jewel, and um, at the time we were very focused on growing, and we only were in the United States, and it's been just a fun ride having these operations all over, and I, I started in marketing. I'm very heavily involved in design. I've always been involved in design, home interior, and continue to fill that role as well as CEO today. Wow, it's such a great place. And the building is huge, you guys. <laughs> and I came here and I was overwhelmed. I'm like, oh my God, where am I going? So um, I had a chance to um, come to Eddie Ross. Hey, Eddie, to his um, framing party. And it was a tea party. It was so nice. And I learned so much about custom framing. I have one picture in my house that's custom framing. That's it. But I do plan on getting more things. And that's why we're here today because you're going to frame a couple of my uh, family portraits, right? That's exactly right. I think the power of custom framing, you really get what you want to live with when you're at home. And that's what's beautiful about custom framing. We're going to change your habits. And you're going to have a lot more custom frames at home after this, I'm All sure. All right. Get me together. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I promise. So tell me how you met Eddie Ross. Well, I've known Eddie for a long, long time. We've been friends for over 10 years. Back when Eddie was with House Beautiful as an editor, he and I worked on a project together, a flea market story. I know many of your readers love to flea market. And we did a story that we went and went to the flea market and bought some button collections and custom framed them and decorated a home with those. Mm -hmm. And since then, Eddie and I have worked together. Eddie really understands the power of custom framing. And I think his rooms are so beautiful. And he is just such a great designer. And what he does with our product is phenomenal. So we were thrilled to do that tea party together just to share the story of the power of custom framing and what it can do to transform a room. Oh, okay, cool. So I want to know what's some um, cool things that you have framed? You know, some of the most interesting ones are always objects. I talked about those buttons. They don't sound like much, but they were beautiful button cards that a young girl had made early, early, early um, 19th or 18th century excuse me, 20th century. And they were cards that she had collected and then sewn them on in beautiful designs. And then you frame them and they look like a million dollars. And I think those are some of the most interesting things are, you know, if you're in Paris and you're on a vacation and you only spent $3 on something at the flea market, you bring it home and you frame it. And it's a memory for life on the wall. And those are the things that really stick out in my mind. A christening gown, a love letter, you know, your grandmother's love letter. or. Oh or maybe her flowers from her wedding or something. Those are just really special works of art that are unique. Uh, uh, unique. Obviously, great art is wonderful too, to frame in your home. Like this piece. Yeah, I, and I love good art. But framing something really personal, whether it's art or an object, is what really makes a difference in your own home and lets you kind of express yourself in your home. Okay, so I know that you have been featured in some great magazines. Could you tell the viewers some of the magazines? Wow. <laughs> it's wonderful that people love to write about custom framing. And I think some of the, the magazines that come to mind most are Traditional Home, Country Living, House Beautiful, um, El Decor. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, um, kind of, uh, Town and Country, mm -hmm. um, Ar Architectural Digest. We've been mentioned in a lot of magazines over the years because people that write about decorating really understand the power of custom framing. And it's just been wonderful to be featured in so many. Oh, that is so wonderful. And I learned so much today with my buddy. And so, um, you guys, when we come back, um, I'll show you um, what we're going to be doing. He's going to frame some of my family portraits. And I don't know what he's going to do. He's going to surprise me. So that'll be the second part of Talking with Tammy. So thank you so much for um, stopping by and um, giving him the website. Thanks for having me today, Tammy. Mm -hmm. And you can find information about Larson Jewel at... Larson Jewel, L A R S O N J U H L dot com. All right. Okay, you guys, we'll be right back with more talking with Tammy.